Hello Sagittarius, welcome to another love reading. This is a you and them love reading. We're going to be looking at how you feel about each other, what's going on in your connection, and what's next. As always, this is a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Sagittarius watching. So just keep that in mind. Take what resonates, leave the rest. If this does not resonate for you at all, then check out my uh, playlist for Sagittarius because not every reading will resonate. So there's a chance that that can happen and that's okay. So let's see, what messages does Spirit have for Sagittarius Spirit? What messages do you have for them in love? This is for those of you that have a connection or someone in mind that exists right now. I can't talk English, so just <laughs> bear with me. All right, Spirit, what messages do you have for Sagittarius? Children and romantic feelings. Your love life is being affected by children. And your feelings are real and worth exploring. Express your love at the bottom of the deck. So I feel like this is very young, very young energy. Uh, like an early relationship, an early connection, but we'll see. What's going on in this connection? What's going on? Death reverse, Scorpio energy there. Six of swords reverse. It's like someone doesn't want to leave this connection. Ace of wands reverse. It never really took off, never really started, but someone doesn't want to end it either. Six of Cups reverse. It's interesting because I was looking at that children card and thinking of the Six of Cups because I just get this sense that this is someone you've known possibly for some of you since you were children. For others of you, there's a past here. And this didn't work out the way you thought, even though this was a very deep connection. Let's see. Tell me more for Sagittarius. Tell me more about this connection. Why is death reverse? Judgment. Someone wants a second chance or is realizing something about an ending here. The Emperor Reverse, Aries Energy. So this is someone that maybe they feel like their hands are tied, like they don't have control over the situation or over how something happens, but they have hope. I have all three. This is all major arcanas here, major energy shifts. The Star, Aquarius Energy. Someone has hope that something is going to take place here with the Star. But at the same time, it's like it's not up to them. So it could be that someone might be approaching you, Sagittarius, or the other way around, um, wanting a second chance. And it's going to be up to you if you decide. That's what I'm seeing so far. What's this star about? Why is this star here? I just heard choose me. Three of swords and the two of swords reverse. Healing. This is about healing. Healing. Choose me. There could be three people involved here and someone needs to choose or there's a choice here that is related to healing a situation. Healing a connection. And again, I'm getting the sense that Someone here is, um, this is out of their control. They're not able to really make this happen on their own. Why is the Six of Swords reverse? Why is the Six of Swords reverse? Ten of sword. 
swords. Eight of swords reverse. Eight of wands reverse, nine of coin, ten of swords. The six of swords reverse could be someone returning to a situation or someone that's unable to leave a situation. I think it's the that that that's the situation. There was an ending here. And someone's unable to really leave and be free. There's a pause, a a delay. Someone's delayed or blocked. But I don't think that this is going to be permanent because I have the Eight of Swords reverse. So all it takes is someone getting out of their head here, seeing a way out of their situation here. If this is resonating, Sagittarius, please let me know down in the comments. Why is the Ace of Wands reverse? Eight of Coin reverse. Why is the Ace of Wands reverse? Someone's not able to put in effort or energy or has not been willing to do that. The full reverse. Yeah, this is all about working, planning, being focused. Someone's not doing that. Tell me about the Ace of Wands reverse. We have two cards here that could be in reference to Aries. So some of you could be dealing with an Aries. See, the Knight of Coin. This could also be financial. Or it could just be that someone's taking their sweet time getting this done. Death reversed again, Scorpio energy. Someone doesn't want this to end between you. Tell me about the Eight of Wands reverse. Why is the Eight of Wands reverse? Ten of Wands reverse. Someone needs to drop a burden. A burden is in the way. An obligation um, is in the way. Yeah, in the way of the, of the new beginning. Ace of Wands. Someone needs to drop it. Drop this burden. Let it go. So let's see. How do you feel about each other? Tell me more about Sagittarius and their person spirit. What do we need to know? about Sagittarius and their person. What energies is Sagittarius bringing to this connection? Tiger, ooh, you know what you want and wanting and want to get it. This is fiery energy, similar to the Queen of Wands for me. Very passionate, sensual, attractive energy here. They are not afraid to go after what they want. So I feel like you're motivated here. Tell me about the person that Sagittarius is dealing with. What are their energies? Tell me about the person spirit that Sagittarius is dealing with. The wolf. So very similar energies here. The wolf is brave and so is the queen of wands or the tiger. <laughs> They're both brave. The wolf is the leader. So you could be dealing that very similar to the emperor energy. Turtle at the bottom of the deck. This is someone that's not afraid of the path ahead. So what is the holdup? I feel like it's that burden. I'm going to use my Stellar Energy Oracle deck to get some more information. If you're interested in this deck, it's linked down below in my shop. It's an affordable deck that you can print at home. Tell me more, Spirit, about these energies between Sagittarius and this person. Tell me about Sagittarius. Now, Sagittarius, I have you on this side. I have your person on the other, but it can be flipped. So feel free to flip the energies if they resonate more for you. Tell me more about Sagittarius and the energy they're bringing to this connection. Moving forward, sweet dreams, cycles, endings, beginnings, fantasy, daydream, imagination. So you're ready to move on or move forward or make some sort of move here towards something that you are interested in or passionate about. Tell me about the person that Sagittarius is dealing with. What are their energies at this time? Burning passion, passion, intimacy, chemistry, and tied up, trapped, stuck burden. So yes, even though they are passionate about getting something started or getting something done here, 
it's not really it's almost like halted it's not going the way that someone expected or wanted so let's get some more information here Spirit for Sagittarius. Tell me more for Sagittarius. What is Sagittarius thinking or feeling about this connection or this person? Ace of Pentacles reverse. You thought that this is a loss, a broken commitment, an offer that hasn't arrived. I feel like you are aware of what's happening with the King of Swords. You might even want to communicate clearly with this person and just air out all of the, you know, just, just talk about the situation. Also, I'm getting that you're not really emotional about this anymore. We got strength here. Beautiful card. Leo energy. You're very calm, collected. There is no BSing you at this point, Sagittarius. Like, you're beyond that. Tell me about this King of Swords. Nine of Cups reverse. Yeah, you understand that this was not something that was granted to you or this was a situation that never materialized for you. You are not um, ignorant of that. You might also be wanting to talk about what happened here. Queen of Wands reverse. Yes, this is something that has not been able to take off. There could even be someone else here or this could be you. Um you were unable to make this happen on your own. Queen of Wands reverse is also someone that doesn't really, um, this could be somebody that made mistakes. You could have made mistakes in the past and are recognizing that, or you're recognizing someone else's mistakes here with the King of Swords. You already know, you know. The King of Swords is very um, no BS, direct, knowledgeable, you know. Why is the Strength card here? For Sagittarius, why is the strength card here? Three of Wands, reverse. I feel like you've been waiting a long time or becoming, trying not to become impatient, trying not to become frustrated at the way the situation has unfolded. Tell me more about strength. Trying to be strong despite it all. Two of Pentacles reverse. Someone has probably, um, they haven't made a choice yet or they're juggling two different things and it's causing delays and you're trying to be patient despite it all. Yeah, this is about someone's depart departure. Tell me about the person that Sagittarius is dealing with. Tell me about the person that Sagittarius is dealing with. What are they thinking or feeling towards Sagittarius or this connection? Empress. Okay, well, <laughs> you are valuable. Um, also, if this is the emperor, this is their empress. They're thinking about growth, expansion, the full reverse. Again with the Major Arcanas. Three of Cups fell out like this, reverse. There's an interference here. This could even be an interference. The Empress, a motherly figure, feminine energy. Um, does not have to be, but I have the Three of Pentacles reverse. So yes, this is an interference of some sort, a person. It's blocking this new beginning. Tell me more about the Empress. Could also be that this reunion is blocked this new beginning is blocked tell me about the empress 
for Sagittarius, please. Why is this Empress here? Judgment, yeah. This is someone that's had some sort of realization or wants a second chance with this Empress. A rebirth. Tell me about the full reverse. Hierophant reverse. Taurus energy. This is about a broken commitment and there's a two of wands. Yeah, this is about someone choosing a different path and going against what's expected. This could even be rebellious energy, someone that maybe nobody expected them to do this or they're going against the grain. This could be somebody ending a commitment and this is seen as reckless or risky to some. Tell me about the three of cups reverse. But I'm picturing here someone that has to choose between two people two totally different directions why is the three of cups reverse king of cups why is the three of cups reverse yep someone needs to leave a third party and they're going to do it because of love They're walking away from a third party because they have feelings or love for someone else. And I feel like it's your person. I feel like they need to like sneak away or <laughs> do this in the dead of night or something like that. So what is next for this connection spirit between Sagittarius and this other person? What's next? Now I'm going to be looking at what's next. Yikes. Knight of Wands reverse, Five of Wands, Nine of Wands reverse. There is conflict ahead, Sagittarius. There is conflict ahead, fights. This is someone standing up for what they want, standing firm, fighting back, facing the challenges. This is all fire energy here with the wands. This is action, fiery you know, risky situation here. Judgment reverse, Empress reverse, yikes. I feel like someone's gonna be really upset <laughs> at what happens here. The Knight of Wands reverse, this is someone that jumps in without thinking, doesn't really plan very well. Um, yeah, this is someone that is, um, it's, this could be your person wanting to go after you, having passion for you, but they're unable to move with the ace of cups this nine of wands reverse yeah the ace of pentacles reverse this is someone that is doesn't has been through a lot and is trying not to give up but there's just loss there's like a huge loss here for this person it could be a broken commitment it could be financial difficulty it could be um an offer that cannot you know maybe there's love but there's no commitment available right now because of whatever this is in the middle here. Um, thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you all in another video. Take care.